Hello everyone, welcome back to SAC Flight video number two. SAC Flight version 1.61. I'm going to show you how to install this version, this new version by Sachan. Uh, so first thing you want to do, use the Creator Companion. The Unity Hub is no longer supported. It will not receive updates from Udon Sharp or the SDK, so don't use the Udon Hub. I'm going to show you how to install the SAC Flight version 1.61 on a new project. Uh, you can update the 1.6 version of SAC uh, by doing the same procedure that I'm going to show you. Um, it will update the 1.6, but uh, hopefully you won't encounter any problems when you go to run it. Um, I didn't get any errors when I did update it, but some weird stuff happened. So I suggest, um, if you can, start a new project with a 1.61 version, uh, unless you got a lot of aircraft in there. Uh, just go ahead and update it, and hopefully it works out. But the Unity Hub, don't use it. So we're going to go to the VRChat.com website, sign in, go to the download section, and you'll see download creator companion now I have creator companion already on here so I'm not going to download it again but you would download it alright so once you have creator companion installed you'll see a window like this disregard all these names these are worlds I'm working on uh, you'll click on new and then you'll click world and we need to give the project a name of course um, we'll just call it Make sure you save the Creator Companion on your C drive. If you do it on any other drive, you may run into issues when you try to pull up your, your project. Uh, okay, so we are going to maneuver to the folder that I created right down here. And let's find it. Do, do, do. Sack flight and select folder so that's where the sec flight new project is going to be saved in that folder right down here create and it's going to put your project up here in the window now this is a new project if you're migrating you'll see a migrate but that's in the first video um, but use creator companion to start your new projects Okay, so over here you can see that it has already the newest SDK, SDK Worlds. Uh, keep that in there. And then the client simulator, that's all good. Now down here you want to add Udon Sharp. So it's going to add the latest version of Udon Sharp. These other ones you don't need to put in there, at least right now, uh, unless you're familiar with it. And then we're going to go ahead and open the project. And it's going to take a few moments for all the Udon Sharp and the files and, and the SDK and everything to compile and, uh, and start your new project. And then we're going to put the SAC flight system in it. All right, so we've got our new project. Clean project, main camera, directional light. That's all we got in here. Um, we need to put a VRC... Spawn point. So you're going to open up your packages, go down to worlds, samples, Udon example, prefabs. You're going to take your VRC world, put it right here in the hierarchy. We're going to go ahead and reset the spawn end point to zero. Let's go ahead and hit play. Make sure everything works. And the client's, uh, the Cyan MU client is already installed, which is really nice. You don't have to download anything else. So that's working great. No errors. Let's go ahead and exit. All right, so the next step to do is put the SAC flight system in here. So let's open up the browser again. Go to SAC flight GitHub. That's where his program is. Let's see. Click on... Once you're here, click on latest. Click on the SAC flight and vehicle zip. Click open. This is the folder you want to copy. Okay, so you're going to right click, copy. And then we're going to find our project folder. 
sack flight that we made on the desktop and we're going to click on assets and this will put the click paste and this will put the sack flight system into your project itself right into the uh, the assets uh, list folder so once this gets installed close that out let's go ahead and open up our unity window again and it's going to start importing the sac flight system into our project and if it doesn't start up right away you can just click on a tab and it'll start the process click on anything in here it'll start putting it in all right so we got sac flight and vehicles in here looking good let's go ahead and do a play And we're good there. Yep, no errors. You can go ahead and put the uh, example scene in there if you want. And we'll just put it right below the, uh, the other scene here. You'll have to remove your, your original scene. All right. So so we've got our scene in here. This is a chance example prefab scene. It's got all the vehicles in here. Uh, it's got the radio and everything else. Everything works great. So the next thing we want to do is if you're going to use this example scene and upload it, make sure, click on um, your VRC world and make sure down here that the blueprint, there is no blueprint ID. If there is, remove it because the champ puts his own ID in here um, but this one does not have so we're good <clears throat> okay so if you want to put um, just individual stuff out you can just go to the prefabs and you can drag and drop your your vehicles uh, anywhere you want them and that's about it really um, if you're upgrading from 1.6 um, you can go ahead and do the procedure I showed you and it should update everything but like I said um, there might be some issues if you can start a brand new project with a 1.61 all right so we're gonna play Take a moment All right, and we are in the world, so to speak, in our Unity editor. This is what you'd see in VR chat. So everything looks like it's working great, and I think that's it, guys. Let me see here. Let's go ahead and exit. So good luck on your projects. And once again, don't use the Unity Hub. If you have projects that's that is in Unity Hub. Hopefully you've migrated them over. Uh, like in my first video, you've migrated them over, uh, my first SAC flight video, um, and you have no problems. But uh, if you're trying to migrate it now, you may run into issues getting it to Creator Companion because of the Udon Sharp. So good luck, guys. Um, have fun with the SAC flight 1.61. See you. One thing to note on the Creator Companion window in the future when you open up your project, scan this list over here. You may see update, especially on the Udon Sharp. Click on update, make sure all this stuff is updated, then you can open your project.